Hello guys and welcome back to the crazy Minecraft video where today the villagers have gone ahead and invited us for a wonderful challenge where it seems like everyone has gone ahead and evacuated the whole village until we go ahead and build this wonderful bedrock bunker. But sadly I think it has something to do with all of these zombies that are scattered everywhere as well as gravestones that belong to some poor villagers. So let's go and speak to them and let's go and see how we can help. Thank goodness you are here Naveed, we are getting ambushed by zombies every night and we can't seem to figure out how to stop them. We have tried everything, our last resort is to build one of the strongest bunkers ever, made from bedrock. Help us complete it. Wait, are you saying it's up to us to save all of these wonderful villagers? Okay, that sounds pretty scary, but I think we have no choice but to go ahead and help them out. And thankfully, they've given us everything we're gonna need. So I'm gonna go ahead and take out all of this wonderful armor, which is gonna be our commando set, which I think looks really awesome. And I did notice right around here, they've gone ahead and given us some wonderful items. So I'm gonna take out all of the skeletons, as well as the zombie corpses. And we can figure out exactly what they look like when we go ahead and put them around. So let me just scatter around all of these poor skeletons, which are gonna be super scary everywhere. And perfect, and even a few skeletons right by the gravestones. Yuck, this is so gross. And I've also realized right inside we have loads of blood blocks, but I'm not gonna to touch those. Let me go ahead and put some of these zombies hopefully right inside. So we've got a zombie villager that looks super scary. And then we also have on the burning stake a zombie corpse, which looks weird as well. But thankfully, I'm really hoping that this is going to go ahead and scare so many zombies away. And let's also go ahead and put on the hanging station another evil blood zombie. And finally, right inside the cages, another zombie villager, which looks absolutely infested. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and build this as fast as we can and thankfully having our commando set on is giving us a bit of a speed boost so let's just go ahead and do this as fast as we can and then we can go ahead and spawn the final golems and then fight off some evil zombie apocalypses villager i'm totally ready but guys don't forget that the majority of you aren't subscribed yet so go down below and press the red subscribe button and look on the notifications bell and that way you'll never go ahead and miss another video ever again and you'd also figure out if we've actually made it through this whole zombie apocalypse because that means we haven't been infected well let me just go ahead and build this wonderful strong bunker but i'm also really scared to go ahead and misplace any blocks because as soon as we do we can't move them so we have to be really cautious right now and i think that should be good enough let me go ahead and do a wonderful bunker door right around there and awesome and let me do the first layer scattered around everywhere I'm really hoping that the reinforced glass they've given us is going to be good enough. So I'm sure it should definitely work out for us. Perfect and good. And there we go. I think the village is going to be super excited. I'm really hoping they're packing everything and ready to move into this wonderful bunker. And the great news is, is that they've also given us some ladders. So we could use them to go ahead and make our way up to the top. So let me just build this all the way around. And then we can do the final layer right around here. See, I've already misplaced the block. We're not going to be able to move that whatsoever. Okay, let me go ahead and get these final blocks which is going to be pretty awesome. And I'm also trying to figure out how the villagers have gotten all this bedrock. They are definitely using some very unusual mods. Okay, I've misplaced two blocks right now, which is not good. And I'm also kind of scared we might not have enough to actually go ahead and finish this other layer. Do you know what? I might have to go ahead and use all this glass. So let me use this reinforced glass all the way around and we're gonna have just one layer of glass everywhere. So we'll be able to figure out if there's any zombies coming towards us and they won't be able to scare us whatsoever. Villager, what do you think? Is this a good idea? I'm kinda scared we might be messing up right now. But this is the only choice we have because if not, we won't be able to place anything around. Okay, I might actually have to get rid of this one because we're going to have to put a ladder unless we can actually place it on top. Oh, we can. Okay, I'm so glad that works. So let me just head back and let's go and see if the villager will give us any more items. Oh, he will. Okay, all of this bedrock should be enough. So now we can go ahead and do the other layer. But I'm actually going to take off this outfit because it's kind of confusing me a little bit. We run well too fast. Okay, let me go and do the final layer of bedrock, making sure that we don't fall off because that will cause a problem. 
and perfect. And let's go and do this. Villagers, I can see you all over there. I'm going to need you to go ahead and hurry up. I think some of the villagers are even farming still. I don't think that's going to be handy whatsoever because the first zombie apocalypse is just around the corner and is about to become nighttime. So whatever they're trying to do is not going to work out for us. Okay, let me just do this layer and perfect. Let's add our ladder and I think that should be good. And there we go. I knew it. We're running out of time. Let me just do this final one right around here. And we're going to really have to push this. Okay, let me just do the final ladder right there. And then we can go ahead and cover up the rest very soon. Villager, come on. We're going to need your help as fast as we can. Making sure not to mess anything up and also covering up this whole area. I'm going to have to actually go ahead and do another layer of glass I think I really don't think we have a choice we're down to our last few bedrocks there we go and perfect okay it's kind of working out great for us so let me just do this final layer completely made out of glass and hopefully this should work out so guys I'll be right back and there we go we've gone ahead and done it I'm really hoping this should protect all the villagers wait is that the first zombie apocalypse? Okay, they're here. Villager, run for your life. I might not have enough time to go ahead and do this. So I'm going to take out a few weapons and then all of our golem items. We're going to have to build as many golems as we can. Ah, here they come. The first few are going to be the most dangerous. So we've got to be really cautious right now. I could actually just fight them as fast as we can. As long as we finish this first wave and we don't mess up too much, we should be good. So let me go and use my infiltrator as fast as we can these monsters are taking over there's just well too many of them okay let me go and use my pistols i'm perfect and we've even got zombie heads scattered around everywhere no <laughs> okay these shotguns aren't working villagers i'm gonna need to swap out some more items okay let's take these out let's throw in the ones we won't need and sadly we are gonna die ah uh, the only ones that are in the bunker right now are myself and i can see all the villagers running away no don't go after the villagers Okay, let me go and build a golem actually right on top of here. I mean, maybe just push him down. I'm hoping that's going to be an option. Let's go see if this is going to work. And perfect. So we push him down below. Come on. There we go. And I'm hoping he should fight them. Yes, it's working. <laughs> okay, I don't think he's going to die. So I'm hoping he should be all right. We can now go ahead and swap out our items and start using it as fast as we can. Let me just use up all of my shotguns. Yeah, this is so gross. Okay, and let's go and use our golden revolver. We can start helping out our golem and make everything better. Golem, I'm going to need some more help. Okay, let me do the diamond one and this should definitely work out for us. Here we go. Let me go and use my golem head. Let's push him down below. And there he goes. <laughs> this is working out perfectly for us. Okay, this can't be too good for us. I've just realized we're all out of weapons and we're the only ones in the bunker. Let me put my electrified iron fence kind of all the way around. I'm going to probably leave an opening though. So let me just go all the way around once and perfect. Making sure not to place these badly either. Because as soon as you do, you won't be able to move these either. So let's go ahead and do this. Let me just go maybe three or four over. And then we can leave the rest as an opening where we can spawn golems. We can do so many cool things and open it all up. Villagers, come on, get inside. I think he's just standing still hoping no one will go ahead and see him. And to be honest, it's kind of working. Okay, I'm all out of weapons. I might have to run down. I'm perfect. And let's just go ahead and change this out. Whoops. Sorry. <laughs> okay, I'm going to have to put these around. And maybe we can even go ahead and block them. There we go. <laughs> We're electrifying them. Perfect. I can't believe that worked. Okay, let's go ahead and swap this out before our golem actually dies on us. So let me swap these items out. Let me throw in the ones I won't be using anymore. And I'm going to have to rush out and spawn as many golems as we can. So I'm going to do the endstone one right around here. And perfect. And I've also got to check on the other villagers to make sure none of them have died. Villagers, are you guys doing all right? You got to make sure no one gets hurt right now. I think we're all good. So let's just really hurry up. Let me do my quartz golem, which is going to be pretty decent. And I can throw in the other electrified fences, the other items I won't be needing. Let's take out our weapons and the final few golems. So let's go and do this as fast as we can. Let me go and do my emerald golem right around here. And I've just realized there is some golden ingots on the floor, which means our golden golem is now destroyed. Oh, this is awful. Let me take out the final three golems we got. So we got our magma one, which is pretty awesome and perfect. Let's go and give him a golem head as well as the 
the TNT one, and then finally we can go ahead and do our obsidian one. And I'm hoping this should work, but I can hear some evil zombies around the village. So let's go make sure our villagers are doing alright. Let's get ourselves ready. Wait, I can hear something. It's definitely around here somewhere. Villagers! Can you guys hear that? I, I can hear something, but I have no idea where it is. I think I found it. It is definitely around here. This is the only place I haven't checked. Aha! Uh -huh, there we go. He's trapped between the statue. Whoops, and he's finally made it out. Here we go. Let's try and aim and fire. Nope, completely missed. Let's go again. How's he dodging our bullets that well? Okay, here we go. Aha! Uh -huh, he's going towards the golem. That's a great news for us. So hopefully the golem should be able to fight him. Whoops, sorry. <laughs> Okay, let's go and do the chicken. And perfect. We've done such a good job. Now we're going to have to go ahead and rush inside and finish up this wonderful bunker. So let's just pop out our items as fast as we can. And let's start building. Okay, I'm going to do all the beds downstairs, which is going to be the safest place to spawn them. So let me just do them all like this. So we've got two, three, and four. Let's do an alarm clock right on top. And then the tables, I'm going to rush upstairs as fast as we can and do them on the first floor. Let me do the tables right around here. Now we've got to remember it's going to be a super basic bunker and there's not going to be much in it. So we're going to have to make sure the villagers know that. So let me do my obsidian chest which is going to be massive and we can start using this to store all our items in. Let me do the furnace, the crafting table, let's once again throw in the items we won't need and we can take out the final furniture blocks. Perfect and good. I think we're doing a great job. So I'm going to put the beddings and everything downstairs. So let's go ahead and do one two, three, and four, with some wall photos of all the villagers scattered all the way around. Come on! There we go. I knew that would work. Let's also go ahead and do all of their clothes pretty much in the corner. There we go, and then the other clothes rack right around there. That opens up with some of the villager rabbit sneakers. <laughs> Those are pretty cool. Let's go ahead and give them some lamps so to make sure it's not dark down here, as well as putting all of our food supplies away from all of the evil zombies. And we can start with our calendar to see how long we've been down below. Okay, let me take out the final item, and then we can go ahead and prepare ourselves for this awesome battle. I think this is going to be really decent. Villagers, I think I'm ready. So let's get out of here, and let me throw in the final items right inside, and let's Let's prepare for the final wave. Guys, watch out! We spoke well too soon! I was just preparing some of the villagers that made it in, and the, all the zombies are breaking through our bunker! Okay, this is not going to be good. Let's go and try and destroy them as fast as we can. And somehow, they even managed to go ahead and climb up. Look, here they come. Okay, let's go and try and do this. And I think we should be good. I am so glad we've gone ahead and set up all of these wonderful electrified fences. No! <laughs> okay, I'm going to have to lure them away from all the villagers. And I can't believe how many there are. And I can see so many of them right around here, which is not good for us whatsoever. Let's just go ahead and use up all of our weapons. And I'm really hoping we should be able to fight some of them. No! Look! It's not working! And I don't think our diamond golem has made it either. Villagers! Run! Let me try and drag them away and hopefully this should be good. I can see some villagers haven't even made it inside their houses. Okay, let me drag in all of these golems into the fight and hopefully this should be good. Villagers! I need your help! Get inside the houses! Perfect! I think slowly by slowly we should be able to drag the golems towards the battle. So I'm really hoping that should work. Look! There they are! They're climbing their way up! This is not good. Ah! Look how many there are! I don't think this is going to be good for us whatsoever. We've literally ran out of items and I don't think this is good. Villagers! Do you know where I can find some more weapons? Oh! Perfect! Okay, I knew the villagers would have some crazy stuff like this. Let's take it all out and let's get ourselves ready. Here we go. Let's open up and perfect! Let's run through and make sure we kill them. Yes! <laughs> Somehow they're able to avoid all of our attacks. This is insane. And I can't believe there's probably so many more as well on these fields. Oh, just the one. Okay, let's head over. Let's go and see if we can kill him. Nope. And he's definitely immune to our attacks for now. I think it has something to do with the sun. So as, as long as the sun is kind of stable, I think it might be all right. Nope, doesn't work either. Oh, there we go. We can kill this one. Perfect. And he's left behind a very ugly head. There we go. Perfect. Whoa, where did he come from? Okay, let's go and get ourselves ready. And I think these should be the final zombies that we have to go ahead and fight. Look, they're right above there as well. Let's go and see if we can do this. And perfect. Okay, let's go and use our alien deatomizer. And hopefully this should work. Here we go. 
Perfect! And good! It's working! We now have a chance to kill as many as we can. Nope, still can't attack that guy. Let's go and get ourselves ready. And perfect. Guys, what do you think? I think slowly by slowly, we've almost done it. We're down to our last few zombies. I do know, as long as you can't hear them, you should be alright. Perfect, we can finally attack him. Can you guys hear any more? Then they could be in the building, so we've got to be super cautious right now. And I can definitely hear them. Okay, it's getting a little bit quieter now, which kind of gives me the news that the bunker is maybe working. The best thing we ever did was put up those electrified fences. Let's go make sure the villagers down below are doing alright, and hopefully this should all be good. Villagers, don't worry, it's just me. I can see them all going ahead and trying to eat all the apples, so they're going to eat all the food in no time. But thankfully, the villagers have made it, and even the little baby ones. Okay, let's get out of here, and let's go make sure we've done a good job, and hopefully we should be alright. Well, I think we've done it. We've still got all the golems around, and I don't see any more zombies, which is great news for us. So guys, don't forget to go ahead and like this video, subscribe down below button is red, and don't forget to go ahead and press the notifications bell. And guys, I'll see you all very soon. Peace out.